Hi everyone, I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com and guess what, we did it. On Thursday night, Thursday the 9th, 2021, September 9th, 2021, we did it. We knocked out the Jaspies 48 box high-end NFL kickoff football mixer, our best football mixer of all time. I really do think so. We've done break, We've done mixers that are bigger than this, but this is certainly the best combination of boxes uh, number of boxes, the type of boxes, the giveaways that we're doing, it, it's its pretty crazy. And we're doing it on the first uh, NFL game of the season, the Thursday Night Football game, which is a pretty good game. Tampa Bay, 28, Dallas, 19, just the middle of the third quarter, a lot of game to go as well. All right, first of all, we only sold 30 spots because there's a couple combo teams right here. Atlanta and Houston were comboed up. Jacksonville and the Washington football team comboed up. So Atlanta and Houston, Jacksonville and the Washington football team comboed up. Um, we are giving away a full spot. So I'm going to do that randomizer first with one dice roll. And then in the different dice roll, we'll randomize names and teams and put you together. So let's do that first. Big thanks to everyone right here. So whether you bought spots straight... Well, first of all, I appreciate the people who got into all these fillers. But only the people that bought full spots are going to be eligible for the full spot giveaway. What's going on here with my keyboard? Keyboard, wake up! But thanks to everybody who got into the action. Now these were the only people that bought spots straight up. Right here. Thank you. So that's an 11 spot list. So one spot in 11 is going to get that bonus spot right down there. Good luck. There's the dice. There's the list. And let's roll it and randomize it five and a one six times. Name on top after six. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Sixth and final time. There it is. Chris Gerard. Christopher, congrats to you. After six times, your name's on top. And you get an extra spot. So we'll put uh, the little rooftop next to your name and put full spot there. Just, there's a lot of text happening here. So let's, uh, let's distinguish it that way so you can separate it from the, from the spot that you won and the spots that you bought straight up. Some people like to separate that and see how, there was, how their spots did. All right. Now let's copy everybody's names. Let's assign you a team. So a blank list for all of the names. There's everybody here. Again, all the teams plus the uh, combos right over there. New dice roll. Let's roll it, randomize it. Two and a one, three times for names and teams. One, two, and three. After three times, we got Christopher down to Sean. Two and a one, three times for the teams. One, two, and good luck, third and final time. After three, we got the Chargers on top. And we've got the Dallas Cowboys on the bottom. We have the ball right now. All right, so here's how it shakes out. Christopher with the Chargers. Sean with the Jacksonville-Washington football team combo and the New York football Giants. Trevor with the Ravens. Brian with the Rams. Sean with the Cardinals. Allen with the Bears, Brian, with the Titans, Alan, uh, Alan Matsui. Alan, we've got two different Alan M's here. Alan Murdoch, Bears, Alan Matsui, Vikings. Michael Robinson, Dolphins. Jeff, with the Bengals. Sean, with my Raiders. Derek, Last Spot Mojo, officially, you're the last person to purchase a spot, full, a full spot. Last Spot Mojo star. We like to keep, try to keep track of it. 70% of the time, Last Spot Mojo hits 100% of the time, we say. Buffalo Bills. Trevor, with the Steelers. Christopher, with the full spot that you won, Niners. John with the Eagles, Christopher with the Saints, Brent with the Packers, Colin with the Browns, Gale with the Seahawks, Bennett with the Chiefs, Derek with the Buccaneers, Christopher with the Jets, Chad with the Patriots, Trevor with the Colts, Christopher A with the Atlanta-Houston combo, Trevor with the Broncos, Christopher Gerard with the Lions, Zach with the Panthers, and Sean Maddock with the Dallas Cowboys. Let's get all this on one screen. We're gonna sort by alphabetically by column B. 
and we're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades, then we'll have the break. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back, folks. Look at this. Spicy, spicy, spicy. Um, Jeff and Chad got a deal done. Chad is out of the Patriots spot and into the Bengals spot. We'll put a T next to there for trade. Jeff is out of the Bengals spot and now into the Patriots spot. I mean, for those of you watching at home, I think we can all see good pros and cons for either side on this. So let's, I mean, we're going to go through, we're going to go through this here. Let's print that out. And let's see what happens. Yeah, Jeff's asking, are you a big Bengals fan? Yeah, Chad's a big Joe Burrow fan and a huge Hawk fan, so I hate Brady. I love it. There's no right or wrong way to collect, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you do it. You can collect with your wallet, you can collect with your heart. All right, there's the final printout, boys and girls. Thank you very much. Oh, and you know what? I gotta keep track of the uh, the hit list peeps. You know what? I'm not gonna do that. Just an interest. I'm, the shipping team will know because they're gonna be sorting out your stuff. They'll know who went hit list. And then that'll that'll be able. To, no, you know what? I'll do it because I gotta send out the break credits. I don't want you to wait for the break credit. All right. So here's how I'm gonna do it. Remember a hit. So if you see right here. Like, I'll just delete the names over there, and so that, that'll, that'll keep track of the hitless people. If you go hitless, which I think is going to be impo almost nearly impossible in this uh, with 48 boxes, if you go hitless, we're going to send you $500 of break credit automatically. So a hit is defined as a relic or an autograph or a relic autograph. If you get a one-of-one -one printing plate, right, I give you the train, one-of-one -one doesn't count. And a five-out-of-five five card doesn't count. It has to be an autograph or a relic or uh, auto rally. All right, so now let's get started. So you can see on this camera right here, all the boxes set up over here. So you can count as we go along if we want to, but we're gonna start off with the, after this, this is like the, this is the one that'll take the longest. After this, most of the boxes are just like one pack per box sort of thing. So this will be the one that takes the longest. So this is 2020 Mosaic Football Hobby Edition. I just want to make sure I grab the right case to start things off. Yes. So after this, everything should be kind of a breeze. So I think this break might take three hours, but I don't think it's going to feel like three hours. So there's the full case right here. All right, well, let's get started. Everyone knows Mosaic. You've seen this. You love this. And we've got, we've got the Cowboys threatening to... To upset? I have them at plus nine and a half. They're covering for sure. They're only down by two at the beginning of the fourth quarter. That'd be interesting. All right, good luck, everybody. It's 2020. Um, John Sadara is saying, hopefully we all hit. V Derek is saying, I'll take that bet that no one goes hitless. Daniel agrees. Can you imagine someone just gets a jersey car? That's still a hit. Remember, even if you don't hit in the mixer, remember the, the, we're still giving away those 10 Jaspies football hit packs.
So there's still still extra chances to win at the end. All right, let's breeze through these. Just in the interest of time, points. We'll randomize that to someone in the break. Winner take all on the points. And all cards will ship. And just in the interest of time, I'm not going to be, um, not going to be sleeving. Uh, I mean, I'll hits I'll sleeve, but I, I won't be sleeving. Like wait, like this Jalen Hurts card, right? We'll have the shipping team take care of that. The sorting and shipping team sort that out. Right for like that hollow as well. And the numbered cards too. 70 and 99 Cole Komet. An all card ship. There's AJ Dillon, Warren Sapp. NFL debut Joe Burrow. Obviously, if it's like a out of 25 or under Joe Burrow, we'll, we'll take care of that right away. And there's our first autograph. Wow. Oh, Brady almost had, who is that? Godwin in stride? There's Tommy Stevens for the Saints. That's our first hit. That's gonna be for Christopher Gerard. That's poor J.K. Dobbins. So yeah, two screen it, ladies and gentlemen, two screen it. One screen for the game, one screen for us. No, Daniel, out of 10 or less? Yeah, maybe maybe for a mixer of this length, maybe ten or less. Maybe not twenty five or less. There's Josh Allen. Carry on Johnson. Jalen Hurts NFL debut. There's Brady, just missed Chris Godwin for a big play. Ooh, and a Patrick Mahomes, five out of 10, gold wave. All right, that's pretty nice. That's gonna go to Bennett and the Chiefs. It's a nice start. There's, our, there's a base Joe Burrow here. That's for the Bengals, that's for Chad. Oh, that red parallel, not number, that's why I'm kind of breezing by that a little bit. And Isaiah Simmons right there, that's box one. Oh, the points. I was like, I thought there were two autographs per box, so the points takes the place of an auto. Yeah, the Kid Reporter spot's going to get a lot of hits. These are expired Kid Reporter cards, unfortunately. This is 2020. So these are the these are the uh, the old kid reporter cards. I think this came out in late 2019, mid fall 2019. All right, box two of 48. And there's Cole McDonald, had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Brian with the 
Tennessee Titans. Terry McLaurin, 23 out of 49. That's for the Washington football team. Cool looking parallel for Sean Maddock with the Jacksonville Washington combo. The Cowboys, you think the Cowboys can win this, ladies and gentlemen? What do you think at this stage of the game? You've been watching the game all day. Brady just missed and just missed him by like a step. There's NFL debut to a Tungo Vailoa and a base to a uh, Michael Robinson with Miami. But Derek says no. Jason Taylor is Sister Joy Taylor uh, is uh, the, the co-host on Colin Cowherd's show. I don't know if people realize that. I only just learned that like I don't know, like a year ago, or something. like very, very recently. And we've got a C.D. Lamb. I think he did. He catch a touchdown today. Let's pull up some stats. Yeah, Jimmy likes the Pats Bengals trade. Let's see how it shakes out in the end. Throws that away. I think C.D. Lamb had a couple nice catches. He does have a touchdown. He's got five catches, 67 yards, and a TD. So a good time to get this one. Sean Maddock in Dallas. David Rodriguez says, I hope they don't win, but the way Dak has come back from that injury like nothing, they're in for double-digit wins this year. Yeah, they're looking good, huh? There's the 99 Gronk. He got a touchdown. That'll go to Tampa Bay. That's going to go to Derek and the Buccaneers. Okay, so Dallas punting it away. So good job by the Buccaneers defense. So I should cross Dallas off the list because they got an autograph. And Titans off the list because they got an autograph. Oh, I already got the Titans auto. Dallas auto. I've got to keep track of the hit list people. NFL debut Justin Herbert and a base Justin Herbert. Uh, those are all going to Christopher and the Chargers. Yeah, double digit wins for the Cowboys, huh? Next box, David Sinkin. I mean, no one's really. I don't want to offend the Eagles fans that work here at Jaspies, but no, I mean, no one's really running away with that NFC East. At least there's no clear-cut favorite preseason, right? Any, anyone could really take that division. You know, Cowboys can go 10-7. and seven. That could be the division right there. 17 games. What does everyone think about the 17th game? Records are going to go down. I think Derrick Henry has already publicly stated that he wants to he wants to use that last game to to put his name in the record books. A lot of passing records that could go down. A lot of records could go down this year. Yeah, I wonder what's going to happen there. I feel like I feel like a lot of teams are already pretty banged up by the end of the season. I don't know. It'll be interesting to see. Like, if teams have playoff spots locked up, are they resting like the last two weeks? Resting like key players the last couple of weeks? It's possible. 
All right, we got Shaq Barrett, Shaquille Barrett, Buccaneers autograph. And that'll be for Derek. Nice Mike Allstott. Odell Beckham Jr. to 49. I got him on on a on a fantasy team. I got two. I got a, I think do I have him in both? I got him on a fantasy team. I think he's gonna have a bounce back here. Ooh, nice NFL debut, Justin Herbert. With a mosaic pattern. That's for the Chargers, Christopher. Jerry Judy Red. Denzel Mims could be an interesting character, pass catcher this year. George Kittle, Taysom Hill. <laughs> Derek only wants to see uh, Brady autos for his Buccaneers. And another Buccaneer auto. This is a Buccaneer box. No, uh, Keyshawn Vaughn for Derek in Tampa Bay. False likes likes the 17th game for the player stats perspective, but yeah, bang, it's gonna have to suck for the team. So might might be banged up. You know, I'm sure there's gonna be. I don't know. I mean, I don't. I don't like that that the, the injury possibility goes up. Let's say a team needs that 17th game, you know. Maybe it's got to be a situation where maybe if it was only 16 games, they would have been in the playoffs, but the team that was behind them won the 16th week, something crazy like there's going to, and they, they're forced to play starters in week 17, and then someone's going to get hurt in week 17 and ruin their playoff chances, blah, 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 blah. Can't really think of the math right now, but I feel like that that could be a possibility. Warren Sapp, J.K. Dobbins, and a Joe Burrow base card. It's a false start. No. Here's Dak Prescott looking pretty good tonight. He's got he's got 333 yards, three touchdowns, and an interception. 36 for 50 passing. At the moment, still still some game to go. All right, next box. It's crazy. Buccaneers are only up two. I think they were like minus minus eight. I think they ranged from minus seven to minus eight, or to minus nine. I think at one point, minus nine and a half even. But they're only up by two. Now, if they come to a position where maybe it'll come down to a field goal for for the for the Cowboys. Greg Zerline hasn't been very accurate tonight. Jeff, the teams that were comboed were Jacksonville and Washington football team and Atlanta and Houston. So if it comes down to Greg the leg, 
There's Teddy Bridgewater, Tom Brady, Patriots edition. And we got a Nikhil Harry for the Pats. Jeff. Jeff Sarsoon drawing first blood in the trade. Chase Claypool, Brian Edwards to 99 for my Raiders. NFL debut Justin Herbert, Justin Jefferson, base Justin Herbert. And we got a Michael Pittman Jr. autograph. Rookie autograph for the Blue Horseshoes, Trevor. This is interesting. Trevor, I'm looking at his name right now. Trevor... Won a spot in the mixer with a mosaic pack break and then won the $3,000 mixer spot. So a lot of dollars saved, Trevor. Thank you. And congrats. Terry Bradshaw blue to 99 for the Steelers. Uh, Edward Delaire, red parallel. All right, Joe, see you, man. All right, see ya. Some of these cards are kind of sticking together here. There's Yannick Ngakwe, who's uh, with my Raiders now. Which I'm excited about Raiders defense was so terrible last year wow fumble wow did they lose is that Fournette trying to get into the end who's trying to get into the end zone is that Godwin I only saw that out of the corner of my eye Got a cowboy down. They're going to review the... So Godwin gets it. And then spins and tries to get to the end zone, but spins and loses the football. Squirts out, picked up. I mean, he could have just gone down, but he spun, got flipped up in the air. Loses the football. Picked up cleanly, it looks like. No flags. Cowboys ball. Interesting. Four turnovers by the Buccaneers. Well, Dak, the Cowboys have to capitalize here. Next box, next autograph. Anthony Miller is your auto for the Bears. That's Alan Murdoch. Won a spot. Gets his first auto over the break.
Jalen Hurts for the Eagles. It's going to be for John with the Eagles. Let's see if we can find some parallels of him. NFL debut Joe Burrow for the Bengals. Introductions, Joe Burrow. And we got a James Morgan. Rookie auto, still a Jet here. That's for Christopher Gerard and the Jets. He's actually with Carolina now. Carolina is hosting the Jets. He's a spy. To win it, Tom Brady. Eddie George Silver, Steve Young Red. T. Higgins, Tua, NFL debut for Michael and the I think Michael, yeah, Michael and the Dolphins. He won that spot too. Another catch. Here's a base Tua, Michael. Ooh, and a Yannick Ngakwe, one of one. That's still Jaguars edition. That's going to go to the go to Sean Maddock, who won that spot from a filler spot that he won. Won a mixer spot, won the spot, gets the Jacksonville Jaguars-Washington football combo, and gets a one of one Yannick Ngakwe, current Raider. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. Got high hopes. High hopes that he will at least, at, at, that he will make the Raiders at least a league average defense. We were, uh, look at the Raiders wins and losses last year. They went eight and eight last year. There were three games that they had lost by within, definitely within a couple field goals, probably less. They could have had 11 wins. There were a lot of 11 win teams last year, but they could have had 11. They might have been in the, the they were in the playoff conversation until those, those losses. Very frustrating as a Raiders fan. So hopefully if they clean that up a little bit, if they get a little lucky, Mahomes is a down year maybe. Herbert has a sophomore slump. <laughs> Then Raiders time. Another first down for the Dallas. Oh, but a flag. on the off and that's a killer. Uh, the stain these stained glass cards show up pretty often I think. I think they're they're a lot more common than in I think basketball they're actually really short printed. But I think in football they seem to be a little more common. And there's J.K. Dobbins. Poor J.K. Dobbins. That goes to Trevor and the Ravens. That's another spot where Trevor won the spot into a mixer and won the, the full spot. Might just be thrown to a drawer and hold on to for next year.
Or am I mixing that up? Is it short printed in this set? There's Jonathan Taylor blue to 99. NFL debut, Joe Burrow. And a cowboy here, Denny White. Danny White. Old Dallas Cowboy going to Sean. I think the, the Cowboys already hit a little bit earlier. There's blue chips. Tua. Von Miller, Kelsey. Well, good news, ladies and gentlemen. All cards ship. So if there's like a weird short print that I miss or something like that, fear not. It will go out to you. DeAndre Swift. And we've got a Jordy Nelson Gold Wave. 3 out of 10. Packers. Brent, Green Bay. There's a Drew Lock stained glass and a Joe Burrow base. All right, next box, cruising along. Not sure what I'm gonna do next after this. Maybe some. We've got a couple more base heavier boxes over there, but this is really the big, the heaviest base product right here. Everything, everything else after this should be kind of a breeze, which is which will be nice. It'll still it'll still gobble up some time, but I think it's gonna be. It's not gonna feel like it. All right, two minutes. First down and more. They're in Tampa Bay territory. All right, next box. Good luck. We got Jordan Love. Nice. J Hart. And there's a CD Lamb. Jay Hart going to Brent and the Packers with a spot he bought straight up. Possibly getting the, the future of the Packers organization, maybe as soon as next next summer. We'll set that CD Lamb aside. He's playing well. Derek Brown to 99, Carolina. That's going to be for Zach. Brett Favre. Joe Namath, Josh Allen, Minshew, Taylor, Mahomes, Love, Jefferson. Joe Burrow. And we've got Carlos Rogers autograph for for Christopher and the Niners. First hit for the Niners today. Carlos 
Carson Wentz silver. Got a Jalen Hurts mosaic parallel, LT red for the Chargers. NFL debut. Hurts. Joe Burrow. And Bengals, all those all those Joe Burrows will add up, of course. Possible grading opportunities there as well. Let's see if we can find some parallels of Joe Burrow. That'll be even better. Joe Burrow has a lot of interesting weapons. I'm not sure that offensive line was kind of was kind of terrible last year. You would think that the offensive line, like that, they must know that that was a problem last year. If a casual like myself, I'm no football coach, right? But if a casual like myself can notice it, surely the organization does. They must have improved it. So. If uh, if they give Joe Burrow just a couple extra seconds, right, right, and they've got a bit of a running game, don't they, Chad? You got Jamar Chase, you got T. Higgins, second year T. Higgins. That's always good for for young receivers. They're like getting that first year out of the way. And he was pretty good in college. I think they still have. Tight end, they, they, they got an okay tight end, I feel like. An outlet there. They got a decent running game to keep defenses honest. Joe Burrow can move around a little bit. Yeah, Joe Mixon's not bad. At least to keep defenses honest. I don't know about their I don't know about the Bengals defense themselves, but I think the Bengals will be a fun team to watch. It, right, it is the issue, right? Oh, the O-line. Is it still an issue though? Here's I'm speaking of the Bengals. Here we go. Chad Johnson. But they must have addressed it. So even if the, even if they're what, if they were bottom of the league in offensive line, even if they, it's like my Raiders in the defense. If Raiders have league average defense, that could be interesting. So that's a hit for Chad Daw, by the way. So if their O line, if let's say their O line was the league worst, if their O line becomes league average or maybe a little bit below league average I mean that that could be just enough for Joe Burrow to have a big year I mean he was already playing pretty well leading up to the injury last year so I'm rooting for I'm rooting for the hobby you know what I mean I want Joe Burrow to do well there's T. Higgins right there. I want Tua to do well. And there's A.J. Dillon to 25. Nice uh, white mosaic parallel for the Packers. That's going to be for Brent with the Go Pack Go. There's, I want Tua to do well. There he is for Michael Robinson with Miami. All those two as will add up as well. Third down and 16 with a minute 37 left. Is it going to come down to Greg Zerline? Yeah, they are really clean. I like those. Numbered out of 25 as well. Prescott, pass thrown. It's going to be just short of a first. Not just short, but well short of the first down. And there's Denzel Mims. What's Denzel Mims' stock? That's Christopher with the Jets. They've already hit before. Zach Wilson there. Corey Davis as the wide receiver one. And then guys like Denzel Mims, or is he hurt? Mims and, and Elijah Moore could be some interesting weapons for the Jets. I think Jets could also be one of those teams that 
may not win a lot of ball games, but could be could be fun to watch. Russell, Russell, Zach Wilson slinging around. Josh Allen blue to 99 for Buffalo. Derek. Oh man, here's Zerline, 48 yards. Missed two field goals already, I think, in the 30-ish range and a PAT. This looks shaky otherwise. Oh my God, he's gonna hit it. Nails it right through the middle. Woo! Forget about it, what you did earlier, Greg. Wow. There's NFL debut, Justin Herbert. There's a base, Justin Herbert, right there. Chargers, Christopher Gerard. And Chase Young. Four more boxes to go. Almost there. Brady still has a minute 24 left. I can't believe it either, CJ. I can't believe he made that kick. He just looked so shaky all night. Even the even the kicks that he were making looked like they were leaning left. And take this 48 yarder, nails it. Oh, you're playing against Greg the Leg in Fantasy. Not a good start. Brady's 8 and 18 when he needs a field goal to tie or take the lead after getting possession within the final three minutes of the fourth quarter. Pretty decent. <laughs> Almost half the time he's going to do it. I know, but Rex is saying Brady's washed up. Sell now. I don't know. We'll have to wait. Give it play to the whistle, Rex. Give it one minute and 24 seconds before we declare Brady washed up. And there is Jason Peters for the Eagles. Eagles autograph going to John Sodaro. Ooh, almost intercepted. Cole Komet, DJ Shark. That's the first down. We've got a timeout left as well. And we got a Jeff Okuda Lions autograph. I think that's our first Lions hit. Yeah, Christopher with the Lions. And a red NFL debut to a Tunga Vailoa. Michael with the Dolphins.
A lot of Let's Go Cowboys chants out there. NFL debut, Justin, uh, Jalen Hurts, that is. Zach Ertz, silver. Brady back to pass to Gronk. Gets out of bounds. Base Joe Burrow. Tyree Kill, TJ Hawkinson Blue for the Lions, 99. Another first down, they're across midfield. No more timeouts, clock's ticking, tick, tick. Tick, tick. Brady la launches it. No, nothing. It's a pretty, if, if this is an indication of what the NFL season is going to be like, ladies and gentlemen, I'm into it. What a catch. A little Godwin redemption there with that catch. Ooh, Godwin goes to the sideline, turns and back shoulder, gets it right at his kind of tummy area. A Geno Atkins autograph for Chad and the Bengals. And a red Jalen Hurts. I hope, I hope Jalen Hurts has a good start to the year. That'd be good for the hobby. There's a lot of question marks around him. Eagles, that'll be for John Sodaro. Rod Woodson, Steelers. There's Jalen Hurts again, base. All right, 14 seconds left, second and 10. And throws it away. I, mean, I think they're well within field goal range. Third and 10. 10 seconds left. Denzel Mims, Jordan Hicks, blue to 99. Joe Burrow, NFL debut. Chase Young, Joe Mixon. Brady throws it away again. I think he was just looking for the right play, but. Fourth and 10, seven seconds left. Kicker coming out. Ooh, nice Brandon Ayuk rookie auto for uh, Christopher for the spot that he won. That's the uh, that's the full spot, the extra spot that he won for buying full spots. It's the Brandon Ayuk autograph. Niners. Here's the field goal, 36 yards. Jason Jaspi needs suck up points. The 
kick is up, it's good. Wow. Buccaneers win 30. Well, there's still two seconds left, but short of a miraculous touchdown run, Tampa Bay 31, Dallas 29. So Rex, I guess I guess Tom Brady's not washed up. Hey, and there he is, Tom Brady, Patriots edition, 46 out of 49. Purple parallel. This is uh, MVP's insert for Jeff and the Patriots. That's right, Mark. Oh, I I I, I got my uh, my offshore had it at uh, plus nine and a half, and now I fired on that. I was like, I had to take that, and a couple two us to close out this box. Uh, I, I Brian, I think his his tongue was firmly in his cheek, but. But no, I, th I think he's going to be fine. I think he's going to be just fine. <laughs> Jeff, were you concerned about going headless? 12, uh, 9, nine ten boxes into a 48 box break? Uh, Prescott with 400 yards, Brady with 380, 4 TDs, 2 interceptions, Prescott 3 TDs, 1 interception. Mark Delara, do you have any uh, do you have any weekend picks for us? Inquiring minds want to know. I guess Cowboys do have one more shot here. I, know, I hear you, Brian. Yeah, Brian's, Brian Wilhelms is saying, just blows my mind. It's another year. And Brady just keeps it going. It is pretty. It is pretty crazy. And we've got a redemption, Lamichael P. Ryan, and an NFL debut, Silver, Joe Burrow for Chad and the Bengals. And the Lamichael P. Ryan is a Jet, and that will be for Christopher. I think the Jets have already hit, yeah. Oh, a little missed lateral, and that's, yeah, that's game. Tampa Bay 31, Dallas 29, first Thursday night game. First game of the NFL season is a good one, boys and girls. Hopefully, uh, this is a sign of things to come this season. If every game can be like this, that would be awesome. There's Brady right there. Oh, and an introduction's Herbert. Joe Burrow base. It's just who is Brady a second half player. I, I actually don't know the numbers on that. I'm sure in the many years that he's been playing, he's had slow first halves and then warmed up and then vice versa, or put together complete seasons. I think he's played long enough where he's kind of probably done it all. Pretty incredible. Derek with the bucket. Some, somewhere in an attic, there's a painting of him grow, growing older. But I guess when the when the fall happens, though, I feel like it happens quick, right? I think Peyton Manning was just cruising along, and then all of a sudden, one year he was just noodle arm Peyton Manning. Didn't that happen? Kind of happen with Breeze too. I think Breeze was cruising along, just looking like MVP candidate every year, 
And then all of a sudden, here's Kenneth Murray. We've got a nice tool right here too. Kenneth Murray autograph for the Chargers. That's for Christopher and the Chargers. Maybe we'll find some Herberts later on. But look at this nice mosaic pattern. Tua Tungavailoa for Michael Robinson and the Dolphins. Not a hit, officially, but a nice card. Mark saying, haven't placed his bets for Sunday yet. No, yeah, nor have I. It's a Saturday night thing. But looking at Detroit plus eight and then Dolphins plus three. All right. It's Clyde Edwards Elaire, Saquon Barkley. Hopefully he's healthy. That would be good for the hobby. Barkley for the Giants, Sean Maddock, and the silver Clyde Edwards Elaire for Bennett and the Chiefs. He did have that neck injury. Peyton? Yeah, he did have that neck injury, but like the first year or two with the with the Broncos, that dude dropped like 50 touchdowns or something like that. But then, like, that one year just happened fast. All of a sudden, he was like Noodle Arm Peyton Manning. So I suppose it could go away that quickly, which is, which is scary. But at the moment, Brady seems ageless. We'll have to see how the rest of the season pans out. But at the moment, seems ageless. All right, last mosaic box coming up. No, Fouts, I was just saying, Fouts saying, what a great game. Watch the whole thing. Didn't disappoint. I agree. I was saying, if, if every primetime game could be like this, if every, I, I can't imagine every game's going to be like this, but if every primetime game, if every Thursday night game could be like this, because Thursday nights are sometimes notorious for being, being a, little, uh, a little meh. I guess as the season goes on, those short weeks can, can impact teams, but... So this was a good way for the 2021 NFL season to get out of the gates. You know, Gronk looks a little uh, looks a little revived as well. And speaking of the Raiders, Mark was saying our Raiders hopefully take care of business Monday. All running backs for Baltimore injured. I agree. That makes life easier for the, the revamped Raiders defense. He might be involved, but this goes to the Raiders. That will be Sean Maddock. But yeah, hopefully, hopefully that, that helps the Raiders. I kind of like that. I think the last, when I looked last night, Raiders were like plus four something. Yeah, Rex. I mean, Rex. It's 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 just kind of scary with with sports in general, not just baseball or football, basketball too. Sometimes, the, one season you got it, especially when you're when you're an aging player. One season you got it, not, next season, it's just not there. It'll happen. To, it'll happen to Brady at some point. It'll happen to LeBron at some point. It's gonna happen to Mike Trout at some point. And there's a couple Justin Herberts there for Christopher and the Chargers. Father Time. They're at plus four. Yeah, Ra Raiders are your hometown team now, no? Derek, you don't like that? I'm excited about it. Plus four is a weird number, though. Yeah, I try not to. In fact, if anything, Mark, if anything, I'll... Uh, let's see what happened here. Ooh, Justin Jefferson, nice. If anything, I'll intentionally bet the other side. <laughs> Just so if, if like if my if my team loses, then I'll be like, well, at least I make money. 
And if they win, I don't mind losing money. Right, for Griffey, it happened in the middle of his career. Right? It's kind of weird once he... I mean, injuries derailed. Injuries derailed uh, Griffey for sure. By the time he's with the Reds, just went downhill pretty quickly. All right, by the way, nice Justin Jefferson, uh, red, rookie auto, sorry, Alan Matsui, forgot to uh, shout you out there. Thanks for, uh, thanks for getting in. You won that spot in one of our fillers, so thanks for taking, being a part of that. And you get Minnesota's Justin Jefferson, who had a, I think he, I think Justin Jefferson kind of spoiled us this year, because now we're, now we're thinking, oh, well, of course there's going to be another rookie wide receiver, because usually, traditionally, it takes wide receivers maybe a year or two to really kind of settle in, right? But Justin Jefferson just hit the ground running. So now everyone's thinking, who's the next? You know, I guess Brandon Ike had a nice season too, but now everyone's thinking, well, who's the next uh, next Justin Jefferson? So who is the next Justin Jefferson? All right, guess what? First 12 box is done. Let's get into some 27 retail, some 2020 first off the line. Who was one player in any sport that went out the way they came in, just crushed from start to finish? From start to finish. Well, usually it's the players that know when to hang them up before they reach a decline. So I guess that would be the question. Which players hung them up before the decline? Now there's Jordan Wizard years. Mark, come on. Calvin Johnson, Barry Sanders. Those are guys that from start to finish, and I think those are the two guys that kind of ended their, retired a little on the earlier side as well. They could have dragged it out a little bit. So we're in 2017 now, by the way. And we should start getting into getting into a zone where, where it's just all gonna be pretty much one pack or a few packs per box kind of situation. That's true, Kobe did put score 60 in his last game. Although he didn't start, if people forget that his first couple years in LA were a little, were a little rough. Anyone else think of examples? I mean, maybe we have to look just we have to just look at rookies of the year. What would have Jordan done if he had never gone to the White Sox to stay in the NBA? He'd probably win a couple more championships. Jeff, you just watched Kobe's last game. Oh yeah, yeah, now. Every once in a while, I'll, I'll watch, re-watch re like highlights of that game too. And now within context, it's very sad. Actually, there was a dunk contest in 97 for Kobe. Yeah, I mean, that team was still pretty good without Jordan, so it's like, so with Jordan, I think I feel like they would have made chips, lots of the whole bowl of chips. There's Sammy Watkins to 299 for the Rams. There's Brady. Patriots edition. Remember, all card ship in this too, so you'll you'll get everything here. Evan Ingram. We we're all waiting for the Evan Ingram um, breakout season. Kenny G, rated rookie. Jeter from start, to, yeah, I think Derek Jeter from start to finish, if I remember correctly, is pretty good. 
Silver Tom Brady, Patriots. Tuan Taylor. Brian Hill. Yeah, Tim Duncan probably start to start to finish. Uh, Derek School Mercer plays Alabama on Sunday. I hope they post a line. You want plus fifty. You think you'll get plus fifty? Do books post lines that big? Even even for like Mercer? Who's maybe a borderline division two school <laughs> against Alabama? You think they will and won't be enough? I don't know. I don't. I don't really. Actually, I, I don't really follow college too closely, so I, I couldn't say that whether or not I've seen ever. Have Have you seen lines like that? Plus fifty, fifty point lines. I feel like I don't know. Here's first off the line. By the way, this is going to be interesting. I feel like. Uh, I feel like Vegas wants you to take that. And maybe you're right. I think you're right. You think they will post it at plus 50 and won't be enough, Derek saying. So you, so yeah, maybe they are they are like kind of tricking the public. Tricking the public into taking the plus money plus the points. Right, knowing that it's gonna, knowing that Alabama will probably beat them by 60, 70 points. You'll take plus six, 56 and a half. Tony Gwynn, yeah, R.I.P. Tony Gwynn. That's a good one, Rex. Start to finish, he was pretty good. Watch local news. Sorry, NBC. Plus fifty six and a half, but I feel like Vegas thinks it'll be sixty five. I think they're just gonna. I think they want you to take that number. I, I get suspicious with that. It's like it looks too good to be true. But I don't know. I feel like it takes a lot of guts to lay that, to lay those points, right? Yeah, Jordan version one, absolutely. If we don't, if we don't cart. Count Jordan Part Two. <laughs> I know, but like I feel like, right? It's too good. If it's too good to be true, sometimes I'm. Sometimes I just pass on it because like, they want you to take that line. Why are they doing that? Though, you know. Like, I'm just thinking. Because the argument, and, and uh, trust me, I'm, I'm not saying I, I I follow my own argument. I'm telling you, I fall prey to it too. Because I'll be like, well, they're giving me half a point over eight shutdowns. <laughs> right, yeah, it'd just be, just be like, it wouldn't be any significant, a significant wager, but. There's Jared Goff, Dominator's autograph from first off the line box. That's, uh, that's still Rams edition. That's gonna be for Brian Frank. First uh, official hit for the Rams, five out of 25. Thirty-one out of fifty. Devin Duvernay, rated rookie autograph for the Ravens. I think Ravens already hit Trevor with that one. We got Dalton Keene to one ninety-nine. Josh Kelly. So we're back in 2020, by the way. Marlon Davidson to 35. Lime Green for the Falcons. Jason Huntley, Hollow. And a Justin Herbert rated rookie. That's nice. Let's see if we can find a parallel of that. Another uh, Herbert for Christopher Gerard. Dwayne Haskins to 299. Ben DiNucci, I think this might be exclusive to this set, it's 25. 
Dallas. That'll be for Sean Maddock. Almost beat the Bucks today. C.J. Henderson, rated rookie autograph for the Jaguars. That's Sean Maddock and the Jacksonville Jaguars, Washington football team combo. Rated rookie hollow, Jordan Love. We love it. Brent with the Packers. Mari Cooper had a nice game today. A lot of people talking about LaVisca Chenault Jr., maybe breakout candidate. There's John Hightower, the fourth, 299. And next box. Boxes. I think these might be the last boxes with, with a lot of cards in there. We're going to go back in time. Ladies and gentlemen, back, 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 back to 2012. Yeah, Rex. In team sports, absolutely. Maybe even sports history. Yeah, Jordan. Three peaks, retires, comes back, knocks out some more. Yeah, he's, he's pretty good. You know what? I'm I'm now interested in. I'm not interested in your opinions, ladies and gentlemen. Um. Eagles at Falcons. Falcons minus three. Home favorites minus three. Who does everyone have? I personally, and these aren't official picks, but I'm just kind of talking it out. But I like the Eagles as road dogs plus three. No, Rex, I don't. I don't know. I remember the last time I had a Mountain Dew. If I enjoy a, a sugary carbonated beverage, it's usually a straight up Coca-Cola. Sometimes a squirt or a 7-Up. But it's rare that I have, have, have stuff like that. I like the Eagles plus three. I think road, short, like short road dog. I feel like it could be a good teaser team too, the Eagles. Steelers at Bills. Bills are minus six and a half. This is all according to, I think, whatever lines ESPN has right now. I think I like the Bills minus six and a half. Vikings at Bengals. Bengals are, are, uh, our short home dogs, Bengals are plus three. I kind of like the Bengals at plus three right there, too. All right, 2012, back in time, back when Brandon Taylor was a rookie for the Chargers. I think Charge already hit before, but Christopher Gerard with that out of 149. And we'll do a recap at the end of this break. I don't know, this is going to be a long video. Maybe I'll do a recap in a separate video. We'll see. We'll find out. Probably a separate video. There's Fred Jackson Green. It's Doug Martin rookie. AJ Green. Josh Gordon. What could have been for Josh Gordon? Here's a Russell Wilson rookie card, Prism rookie card for Seattle. Gale with the Hawks of the Sea. It's pretty nice, right? I can't really eyeball it right now, but can't really tell right now, but if that grades out nicely, it'd be cool to have a, a PSA 9, PSA 10, Russell Wilson Prism rookie card. I think this is a, there's something different about this set. This is a retail box, by the way. So this is a retail box from, from back in 2012.
Chad, Chad wants to trade you a couple of burrows for that uh, for that Russell Wilson rookie card. What does that go for? Oh, there you go. Booney is saying, Boone Prism is saying that the Wilson Prism PSA 10 is about a little over 1000 to 1200 bucks. That's not bad. Here's 2018 select first off the line. Nick did include a lot of first off the line here. Oh, see, this is why I do the check. Look at that. If it was just like this, I don't think I ever would have seen the pack. Especially with select boxes, you got to check. All right, back when retail actually sold as retail. This is select first off the line. Let's, let's look at a few more games here. Niners minus eight, Lions plus eight. Lions at home plus eight. I think Mark was saying earlier that he liked the Lions plus eight. That's a tough one. I think the line was at Niners minus six and a half or seven, which I which I like. Yeah, imagine someone dumpster diving and found that pack. I should have saved the pack. I should have seen what was inside. I should have set that aside. Oh well. Ooh, I, I like short home dogs. I like the Colts plus three. They're hosting the Seahawks, speaking of Russell Wilson. Kind of like that. All right. Select that second year Mahomes. Rookie Josh Allen, DJ Moore, Tyreek Hill, all sorts of things popping already. So let's protect that Tyreek Hill die cut. That's 48 out of 75 for the Chiefs. Josh Allen, Bills, Derek, Last Bot Mojo, rookie card. DJ Moore, rookie silver, and the Patty Mahomes, second year. Got Mike Kosicki, six out of nine. Nice. Remember, this is uh, first off the line, so you'll see different numberings and different parallels here. DJ Shark, do, 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 do. Drew Brees to 99, and an XRC, uh, well, what draft is this, 2019 NFL draft, defensive player number one, who's the first defensive player taken in the 2019 NFL draft? That is going to be Nick Bosa for the Niners. All right, so San Francisco, that is going to be for Christopher. That's Brett Marr. And a Calvin Ridley to 23. Ooh. Nice three-color patch and autograph popping here. That's Atlanta's first hit. Christopher A. Christopher Atazian with the Atlanta-Houston combo gets the nice rookie patch auto Calvin Ridley. That's a nice hit. Aaron Jones is not a rookie. I thought he was a rookie for a second. Saquon's a rookie. That's nice. Need him to bounce back strong. That's hashtag good for the hobby. To 199. Jalen Samuels. Anthony Miller. Rodgers. Darius Geis to 49. For Washington. Points, we'll combine it with that. Sorry, I don't like when they flip the points around like that. Christian McCaffrey and Lights Camara action. Nice tie-dye for the Saints. I think Saints already hit, but Christopher Gerard with that. Yeah, this is exactly what uh, what Rex said, Jimmy. Back when retail was actually in retail stores. 
So Mark Delara is saying, I think the Niners defense is just not the same. Then they play the East Coast. You like the Bucks today? Uh, you, I think like today, Bucks wins, but Dallas covers kind of thing. Detroit wins, but Detroit covers. Here's a Target exclusive. Look this up. You'd be shocked at how much these Target boxes go for. <laughs> More points here. Again, winner take all on the points. Is our Darius Stewart silver? Robbie Anderson pink? John Ross? The Oh, that's a good call. The expiration date on that. Well, that shouldn't be. It's June 2020, but... These aren't autographs. These are just cards. They must have those still sitting around. So I don't know. So San Francisco, Christopher, at least try to put it through the paces. Try to put it through the paces and see uh, see if you can actually get that card. Here's John Ross, the third for the Bengals. Premier jerseys. Solomon Thomas, Hassan Reddick. All right, nothing too crazy here. All right, more first off the line. Love all the first off the line that's in this mixer. 2020, so we're back to 2020. Spectra, me, Spectra football. Right, yeah, generally, you're right, Mark. And generally, they offer, they offer some degree of points if... Uh, if, if they don't have the card itself, but hopefully they do. see what we got here. All right, behind Julio Jones, Sony Michelle, championship gear. That's going to be for the Patriots, Jeff. We've got a uh, Respectra dual relic, Joe Mixon Bengals, Deshaun Watson Texans. That'll be a randomizer at the end of the video. 22 out of 75 between the Texans. Uh, that'll be for Christopher A. And the uh, Bengals, that's going to be for Chad. And then we've got Patch Auto, Radiant Patch Auto, KJ Hamler. That neon pink autograph for my rivals, the Denver Broncos, Trevor with Denver. I think this is the first Denver hit. 3 out of 25. There's Julio Jones, one out of 10. Nice low number there. It's Atlanta edition going to Christopher A. Matt Ryan reveals a Jalen Ragor to 25. Behind Matt Ryan is high voltage Lamar Jackson, three color patch. Neon green scope pattern for Trevor and the Ravens. 23 out of 25, Trevor. Behind Matt Ryan is aspiring autographs for the Buccaneers. That's Keyshawn Vaughn. Nice patch. Great colors in there. Nice auto for Derek and the Buccaneers. And there's Matt Ryan to 25. Behind Jalen Ragor, die cut, Chris Godwin. 8 out of 20 had a, almost a costly turnover, but 
They still won the game. Isaac Bruce, 16 out of 25. Championship gear, two-color patch. Rams. It's going to be for Brian Frank and the Rams. Epic Legends, Bob Lilly, two-color patch. Sean Maddock with Dallas, old-school cowboy. Uh, oh, there's the number. Four out of 15. Kind of hard to see right there, but it's there. And behind Jalen, dual relic, dual auto, Cam Akers, Van Jefferson. Van Jefferson. Poor Cam Akers. We'll see what Van Jefferson can do this year. Dual relic, dual auto for the Rams. Brian Frank. And that's uh, three out of 15. Yeah, nice low number there. And the Jalen Ragor is to 75. Eagles, John. All card ship. LaMichael P. Ryan, neon green die cut for the Jets, 8 out of 30. Ooh. Got championship gear, Damian Willen Williams, two color patch. Chiefs, Bennett. I think that's the first Chiefs hit of the day. I think there's been some Mahomes cards and whatnot, but there you go with the spot that, that Bennett won. And there's Xavier McKinney. Giants autograph. That's going to go to Sean Maddock. That's the first Giants hit of the day. And there's DJ Shark to 99. If you're wondering, there's only a handful of teams that have not gotten an official hit. Uh, Derek and the Bills, Zach and the Panthers, Colin and the Browns, Michael and the Dolphins, Trevor and the Steelers, and Gail and the Seahawks. So if that holds, you'll get $500 of break credit to you automatically. But we still have so many boxes to go. Um, let's go to let's go to another another case of stuff. How about some encased? All right, so remember in case, stack some box on top of each other. Remember in case there's a uh, graded card in there, in addition to some other hits. Back to 2020, or staying in 2020, I guess. We'll do the graded cards all at once at the end. In fact, I'm gonna open up all these boxes at once. And that gives me a shot, a chance to look at some other games that are happening. All right, Cardinals at Titans. I, I, I think I, I also like Cardinals plus three as the short road dog over Tennessee. I think, I, who was I listening to? I think someone was saying, someone pointed out that Tennessee has, a, has had a lot of the key guys are still there, but I feel like a lot of there's been a lot of turnover on that team. A lot of new faces out there, a lot of new defensive faces. Something that could be exploitable by an exciting, what could be a very exciting Cardinals team with Kyler Murray. Um, Seahawks. No, we already talked Seahawks Colts, right? I think I like the Colts at home plus three. Chargers at Washington. What does everyone think about that? That's a that's an interesting line. Chargers are road dogs at plus one. Washington's minus one. I mean, Washington defense is really good. Chargers are on the road. Washington defense really good. I think the Washington offense is going to be pretty competent. With Ryan Fitzpatrick, he can always find ways to win. Yeah, I think it's it's Carson Wentz, isn't it? Cold starter? 
Or is he still, or is he still working his way out of protocol? I'm pretty sure that he's going to be starting week one. Oh, yeah, Jace, Jason in the background is saying he got activated. It was mostly a close contact issue. So, yeah, I think he's, I think he's good to go. No touch and go there for a second. No, I think he, I think I think the foot injury or whatever he had was they thought that he was going to be out. They gave a really weird timeline. There was like he could be out three to eight weeks, and it was like really weird. It was a huge range, but it turned out to be on the shorter end of that. So he's back. He got practices in, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So I think he's good to go. All right, Michael Pittman Jr. Triple relic to seventy-five for the Colts. That'll be for Trevor and the Colts. We've got Matt Ryan, piece of his jersey, 25 out of 40. Falcons, that's going to go to Christopher, Christopher A. And go Rams, says Van Jefferson. 75 out of 75 rookie notable signatures. Nice inscription there for the Rams. Camp, poor Cam Akers, 11 out of 60. Rams, Brian Frank. Got T. Higgins out here too, 19 out of 60. Bengals, Chad. Matt Ryan, this time 35 out of 35, two color patch. Christopher A with Atlanta. And Ed Too Tall Jones, 17 out of 25. Wasn't there like a Geico commercial with Too Tall Jones? Is Ed Too Tall Jones too tall? No, we have a lot of hit parade products, Sapphire Edition and Platinum. Sean Maddock with Dallas. Limited is the cheapest of their run. Yeah, Platinum is the cheapest of their run. And you have Sapphire Edition 5 plus. Brandon Iyck. Quad Rally, that looks pretty sharp. Four out of 15. That's for Christopher Gerard and the Niners. Jerry Judy. Substantial uh, rookie swatches. 28 out of 60. That'll be for my rivals. Denver. Trevor with Denver. And the autograph, DJ Moore. 24 out of 25. Reserve signatures. Carolina. That's the that's Carolina's first hit. Zach Teal won the spot in the mystery item break number two. Got randomized the Panthers. Your first Panthers hit. First of many, I hope. Next one, DeAndre Swift, 33 out of 50. Christopher with the Lions. Christopher G. Justin Herbert, ooh, I thought autographed. 13 out of 15. Nice colors there, though. Uh, Christopher G with the Chargers. And back here is Zach Moss. Four out of 50. Rookie auto for the Bills. Buffalo! Derek with the Buffalo Bills. That's the first Buffalo Bills hit, so we can take you off the hit list list. Family sports, what's going on? Any Packers? Yes. Because um, the Packers are not on the uh, on the hit list list. So they must have gotten something. Oh, right. The Jordan Love autograph. That was pretty nice. Some nice parallels, too. And we still have a ways to go in this break as well. Anthony McFarland Jr. to 60. Steelers. Trevor. That's the Steelers' first hit. So they're off the board. Leighton Vander Esch, 34 out of 40. Dallas, that's going to be for Sean. And LaVisca Chenault Jr., 27 out of 50. Go Jags, he says. I've seen a lot of uh, 
so-called fancy experts say that maybe could be a breakout candidate, LaVisca Chenault Jr. Jaguars, that goes to Sean and Maddock and the Jacksonville Jags and Jaguars, the Washington football team combo. Chad, do you remember where the, <laughs> the autograph was, the love autograph? Mosaic, I think, right? Yeah, 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 Mosaic. I don't know if there was a parallel, if it was numbered. But I'm going to do a recap at the end of the video, so you'll spot it. Future Wave, DJ Shark to 60. There's another Packers right here, 10 out of 15. Jordy Nelson, Century Collection. And that's for Brent. DJ, that's right, DJ. Oh, Greg Zerline, there he is. This is a Cowboys edition of Greg Zerline. 63 out of 75. Made a huge, struggled all night, but then made a huge field goal to give the Cowboys the lead, but then Brady did his thing, and then Ryan Suckup hit a, hit a field goal to win it for the Buccaneers. Anthony McFarland Jr., triple relic this time. Two out of 25, Steelers, Trevor. There's more Cowboys, 10 out of 10. Jalen Smith, two color patch. Sean Maddock with the Cowboys. And then we've got Darrington Evans, 14 out of 15. Tighten up, go tight. Two inscriptions from Darrington. Thanks, Darrington. Brian with the Titans, hitting you with those two inscriptions. So it's going to be an autograph right on top. That's dual relic and autograph, Antonio Gandhi Golden. Nine out of 25. That's on a pretty heavy card stock. Looks pretty good. 180 top loader, maybe? That goes to Sean and the Jacksonville and Washington football team combo. I really like the blue foil that they have around the windows right here. You can kind of see that. Earl Thomas to 50, Century Collection Relic for the Hawks of the Sea. That's Gale's first hit. Gail did get the cool uh, Russell Wilson Prism rookie card, but that wasn't an official hit. This is an official hit, though. Devin Singletary for the Buffalo Bills. And then we've got the Michael Thomas base card right here. All right, yeah, generally speaking, the, in, the graded cards are usually the hot ones here. Now, if you're keeping track at home, only two teams now have not had an official hit. That would be the Browns and the Dolphins. Maybe we can change that, that trend here. There's A.J. Dillon, 57 out of 75. The are not alive anymore. 9-10. Uh, we can still get some, I'll move these right here. 9-10 for uh, Brent and the Packers. We got Michael Pittman Jr. Autograph is a 10. Cards an 8-5. 17 out of 15 for the Blue Horseshoes. That's going to be for Trevor. Next up is rookie cap patch autograph DeAndre Swift. 8 out of 50. Jersey autograph 9-9 nine, nine is the grade. Denver. Denver. Detroit. Different D city. Trevor with my uh, F word. Chris Gerard with Detroit. Trevor has Denver. Come on, man. It's been a long week. Jacob Eason. 14 out of 50 for the Blue Horseshoes. 9-10 on the grade. That goes to Trevor and the Colts. Oh, nice Chase Young. Dual relic and autograph. 42 out of 50. Graded a 9, 10. Washington football team, Sean Maddox. How about some Jerry Judy? United in orange is the inscription. 10 out of 25. 
that are great here. Nine, five, ten. Again, my rival is Denver. Trevor has Denver. Wonder Trevor Lawrence on the screen. Next up is nice. Justin Jefferson. Five out of twenty-five. Two color dual relic on card autograph. Nine ten on the grade. Minnesota, Alan Matsui. And then there it is. Tua Tungo Vailoa. Michael Robinson has not hit until this point and now gets a dual relic on card autograph. Five out of 50. Nine, five, ten. Tua Tungo Vailoa. There it is. There it is. All right, now we just need to find Colin some Browns. Where should we go? Should we let's go get let's let's get this uh we're going to get this uh, case of collegiate out of the way. Tw this is 2021, so current draft class. 2021, immaculate collegiate football. The whole case. So just in the interest of time, I know, you know what? I'm gonna pull up the checklist. I'll, 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 I'll tag all of these. I need to change uh, trash bags really quick too. Okay, so there's the football. 2021 on the checklist. Certified Legacy Luminance. Where's Immaculate? There it is. Immaculate Collegiate. I'm going to drop the checklist for uh, for you in the chat as well. So you can follow along if you want to. There you go. I have not memorized all these names yet, so I'm not in mid-season form. All right. We have, uh, well, I know where he goes. Trevor Lawrence, 4 out of 18 for the Jaguars. That's for Jacksonville. We got Dwayne Eskridge to 99. Wayne Eskridge goes to the Hawks of the Sea. Um, yeah, pretty much, Mac. I mean, this is what we have on this side. I mean, we only put people on this side, not on Instagram, so we're only breaking that over here. So that will be for, uh, for Gale and the Seahawks. We got Tamori and Terry. Is that a lightning bolt that he's drawing on there? 30 out of 99, three color patch and autograph. That's going to be for none. So he's not associated with the team. So we're going to be, that's going to make that part of the randomizer. We got Killen Hill, 18 out of 25, three color jersey and autograph. That'll be for Green Bay. That's going to be for Brent. I think I know where this guy goes. Ooh, three out of five. With the Chick-fil-A logo, patch and autograph, Mac Jones. Mmm, Chick-fil-A. Three out of five is the train whistle. Out of fives and under, get it. And Jeff S. got the Patriots in a trade. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Nice. All right, and there's Tyler Lockett right there. John Addy, yes, this is the last break of the night.
Well, Chad, there's still a lot of boxes left. Man, you still got four helmets, some honors boxes, five honors boxes, exquisite, and tea boxes left. Yeah, John, we'll be back at 3 o'clock Pacific, though. 6 o'clock Eastern tomorrow. Around there. But yeah, we've got like another hour to go in this mixer. So that's going to bring us pretty pretty much to the end of the night. Ooh, nice. Pat Fryermuth, 78 out of 104. That's Steelers. It's going to go to Trevor. Introductions, Quiddy Pay. Autograph, 59 out of 99. Payday goes to the Colts. Do they call him Payday? I would. Um, Trevor with the blue horseshoes. Then we've got a Javonta Williams, a Tar Heel, 44. Oh, and a redemption back there. 44 out of 99. Javonta Williams is a Denver Bronco. That's going to go to Trevor. The redemption is Demetric Felton. There you go. That's Cleveland. Cleveland, this is for yeah. you. you Everyone has officially had a hit. Colin was the last holdout. Cleveland Browns. And a free top loader. And a nice Jalen Waddle, three out of 25. Rookie, jersey, and autograph. We got the Tua for Michael Robinson earlier. And now we got perhaps a interesting receiving target for him. Is he the next Justin Jefferson? There you go, Michael Robinson, Miami. And then we got DeAndre Hopkins. All right, next box. Ooh. Oliver likes uh, Javante Williams a sleeper, as a sleeper fantasy pick. Three out of three. Piece of 2 2 Atwell's cap with the new era logo. That's uh, for the Rams. That's going to go to Brian Frank. And all teams have officially gotten an official hit, ladies and gentlemen. There's Javon Holland. One out of ten. Javon? Javon Holland, I think. Out of Oregon. Oh, let's go back to my checklist page. And Holland is a Dolphin, another Miami Dolphin going to Michael Robinson. Another Mac Jones rookie autograph, 13 out of 99. That's going to go to Jeff and the Patriots. Got the patch auto and then got the standard on card auto. That looks really clean right there. Usually Immaculate does run into issues with like edge issues and whatnot, but that looks pretty clean. We've got Javonta Williams. We just we just had him, right, Denver? Yeah, another Javonta Williams. This time it's a, a three color patch. 
an autograph. 98 out of 99. Oliver Soria's sleeper pick right here for fantasy. For season long fantasy? Daily fantasy? Uh, Chad, you can't blame me. There's Trey Sermon, 16 out of 20. Any other time I take the blame. This Trey is, is teamed up with Trey on the Niners. Chris Gerard. Now we got plenty of boxes. We're, 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 gonna, we're gonna balance it out. That's Josh Jacobs for the Raiders. Two more boxes to go. What are we gonna do? And, oh, and Chad, don't uh, remember, we still have those hit packs we're giving away. Top 10. So maybe if you land in the top 10, you can maybe get a huge hit there. That'll make up for it. So there's, there, we're still alive with a little bit of luck. And there's still a lot of boxes left. All right, we got a Des Fitzpatrick, 40 out of 48. What is that? Oh, piece of his gloves. That's pretty cool. Des Fitzpatrick is a Tennessee Titan. Got to go to Brian Frank. One of one all-time greats, Barry Sanders autograph in his Oklahoma State gear. Woo! Woo! Wow, Detroit, that's gonna be for Chris Gerard. There you go, Christopher. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! This has been a great mixer. There's Sam Ellinger, 62 out of 99. I believe he is a Colt. Yeah, he's for the Blue Horseshoes. That'll go out to Indy, Trevor. I don't know if there's been that many train whistles. A few? There's Ramondre Stevenson, 25 out of 25. Stevenson Patriots, there you go. And we've got a Kellen Mond, two out of five. It's another train whistle. That's immaculate is pretty uh, pretty generous with the with the train whistles. That'll be for Minnesota. That's going to go to Alan Matsui. Alan, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. And that's Jonathan Taylor for the Colts card right there. 18 out of 49. Alright, final Immaculate Collegiate box right here. Good luck, everybody. We could use, like, a... I need to make up for uh, for Chad and his bangles. Really need to work on that. But I'm still convinced there's a lot of boxes to go, Chad. All right. We've got Justin Herbert, 
piece of his uh, Oregon gear. That's going to go to um, the Chargers, obviously. That'll be for Christopher Gerard. And then we've got Jalen Phillips. It's Jalen Darden. Jalen Phillips is a Dolphin. That's going to go to Michael. And M, what's going on? How are you? Miami with that one. We got Terrence Marshall, 40 out of 99. That'll be for Carolina. That's going to be for Zach. Couple more here. We got Chuba Hubbard, six out of twenty-five. I think Chuba Hubbard's another Panther. Yeah, a little cat team mojo for Carolina. Zach Teal. There you go, Zach. And back here is patch off, jersey autograph Devonta Smith for the Eagles, eight out of ninety-nine. This guy. This, Eagles are a big question mark to me. I mean, if they got guys like Devonta Smith, Jalen Hurts, Miles Sanders, Zach Ertz, I mean, they've got some weapons there. If they could put it all, if they can put it all together, it could be a really fun team to watch. And that defense is, uh, I think, underrated. Struggled a little bit last year, but and they just had so many injuries last year too. So if they can stay healthy, ooh. It could be a fun team. And the NFC East can be had. It can, it can be got by any team. All right, so again, you have a first case of that Trinity now. Uh, you have a big quarterback out of first box, so. All right. All right, Jalen, they got Jalen Rager from last right, year. You, Dallas Goddard could be the new Zach Ertz. Zach Ertz is still there. some really good stuff here. Uh, wow. It's going to be hard to choose. I think I'm going to close with NT, but look at this. How about some 2006 Exquisite? So this is the kind of stuff we're getting into now, ladies and gentlemen. So this, if you're, if you're, if you're thinking, man, I am having a bad break, Joe. This is where we're starting to get into sort of the higher end stuff where one or two hits could really could really make make the difference. Could really make up for the entire break, really. I got four of them. There's anything hiding underneath there, right? Well, let's see what's been marinating in here since 2006. I actually don't know. Someone look up what what rookie possibilities we're looking at in 2006. Yeah. Hydrate a little bit here. All right, we've got exquisite rookie Martin. Oh, it's the Martin Nance rookie year, duh. Remember Martin Nance? To 150. And in spite of the uh, the Bills helmet, he must have gotten traded or something like that. It's a that's for Minnesota. That's going to go to Allen. We got rookie signature pants, Vernon Davis. All right, so again, we got some, uh, trade there you go, we got some fifty-five out of ninety-nine. Man, he was really awesome for a, a good a chunk of time. Yeah, that's and Oliver saying that's the what Reggie Bush, Matt Leinart, Vince Young year. Vernon Davis, Niners. 
That'll be for Christopher. I think, it, was it Vernon Davis that sparked the uh, Mike Singletary, I want winners speech? I think he might have been associated with that. There is Steve Smith. Nice. 36 out of 75. Giving hope to short guys everywhere that you too could play football. Carolina with that one. Zach with Carolina. Exquisite Patch, Larry Johnson, 11 out of 30. It was Vernon Davis, right? He was just slacking off or something. Something happened. I want winners. I want players that want to win. Woo, exquisite inscriptions, 20 out of 25. Dwight Clark, the catch inscription. That's pretty sweet. Niners, Christopher Gerard. There you go, Christopher. He's a winner. Twenty out of twenty-five. You don't see a lot of. Uh, that's Charlie Fry, by the way, for the Browns. You don't see a lot of. Uh, Dwight Clark. Is, is Dwight Clark R.I.P.? I didn't realize that. R.I.P. Dwight Clark. Till Camp Chancer rung whose bell? Oh, Vernon Davis's bell. And then, and then, yeah, that, that, that's, that's it. Vernon Davis, exquisite rookie, Ingle Martin. Remember him? One twenty-three out of one fifty. Brent with Green Bay. We got Patch Auto, Derek Hagen for the Dolphins. Double, uh, yeah, 002 out of 225. Two color jersey and auto. Oh, uh, Oliver saying, Joe has some great Ingle Martin stories. If I, I could, I could have a whole series of podcasts, Oliver on all of the Ingle Martin stories that I can tell. I, I don't I don't have time in this mixer to do that. Nate Burleson, there he is, he's on TV. Seahawks going to Gale and the Seahawks. Nah, this, the Ingle Martin stories that I can tell, just of his, of his exploits in the, in the pros and in college and just in life, you know? 46 out of 50, a real inspiration. Ronnie Brown, Dolphins, three color patch. I, I, get, I mean, this is the end of my week. My voice is pretty ragged, Oliver. We're going to have to save that for, for when I'm back on Sunday. Uh, Jaspies is back tomorrow here on YouTube, but I'm not back until Sunday. So, Woo! Look at this. Oliver's a Steelers fan. He's going to like this. Five out of five, quad relic and autograph. Big Ben Roethlisberger. Pittsburgh Steelers, Trevor. Bought a spot straight up, gets the five out of five Big Ben. Now there's there's some speculation around the hobby, right? Nothing nothing concrete, but you know with the whole fanatics buying up the licenses, the players association licenses, right? That might put them in play to buy someone like this, which could bring back products like this, exquisite. Five out of five, quad relic and on-card auto, Big Ben going to, once again, Trevor and all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. So, just speculation. And there's Trent Green to 150, can't see. So yeah, so that, that might pave the way for that, Oliver. If Upper Deck can bring back stuff like this. I don't even know where to go now. Uh, well, let's get let's get this certified, this 2020 certified first off the line going. We've got five star impeccable. We've got helmets. 
We'll end. We'll actually end with the helmets. I think maybe a little guessing game would be a little fun. A little audience participation would be a little fun at the end. But the, for the cards, we're going to end with NT. All right, there's Stefan Gilmore to ten. Or should I end with honors? There might be more more monster potential in honors. But we, they are first off the line though. We got Mark Duper, Super Duper, eight out of thirty-five mirror signatures for the Dolphins. Cortland Sutton, three out of 50. This is certified first off the line for Denver, Trevor. Josh Kelly, that's a nice patch, nice auto. Eight out of 10 for the Bolts. That's gonna be for Christopher Gerard. And we got Clyde Edwards Hilaire, piece of his jersey. Uh, 38 out of 50. All right, so that was certified first off the line, which actually looks really sharp. I like all the like the sunburst parallels here. All right, here's what I'm going to do. What's up, Wilson? We're going to do oh, five star. If I don't destroy my camera here, we're going to do five star. All right, we got 2012, 2014. Then we're going to do impeccable first off the line from uh, what year is this? From 2019. Then we're going to do hobby 2016 NT. Man, look at all this great stuff. And then 2020 NT first yeah, off the line. We're going to do that. Then. We're gonna end with three boxes of 2020 honors first off the line, all right? And the bottom two boxes, or uh, sorry, 2020 honors football hobby. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep those over there. And then the bottom two boxes are 2018 honors first off the line. And then we'll end with the, uh, the fun helmets, the four helmets down there. But card wise, this is this is our that and the honors group is it. So fingers crossed. Good luck, everybody. And I think I'm going to do a recap in a separate video. I think it's going to be kind of long. So here's a box of five star from 2012. So that's Russell Wilson, Andrew Luck, etc., etc., etc. Fun boxes uh, that we're gonna empty box that we're gonna give to the kids in our shop here. And there's a book down there as well. I did not bring slider boxes. Hang tight. Yeah, that was uh, 2014, I think, was the, t the 2014 football stuff was one of the, um, I think one of the first, like, l first products that I, I did football-wise, breaking-wise. So it's, it's been a while. So we've been doing this for a minute or two. There's Torrey Smith, 139. A lot of 2014 five-star football, a lot of 2014 triple threads. That was Odell Beckham Jr.'s rookie year. And, and he made that amazing catch, and everybody wanted to collect him. That was, that was really one of the first first rookies and first products where it really started heating heating things up for the hobby. All right, 231 out of 300. Three-color patch and autograph, Ronnie Hillman, Denver. Denver rookie patch auto going to Trevor. We got Colby, uh, Kobe Fleener, 
007 out of 200, rookie autograph for the Blue Horseshoes. Another one for Trevor. Ooh, and there's a redemption there. Unfortunately, that's definitely going to be expired, but we'll send it out anyway to whoever it is. That is Jim Plunkett. Five-star signatures gold auto for the Raiders. But expired back in 2016. I, I mean, also, we'll ship it. And I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe Panini, that's, that's the risk with doing some of these older products. But maybe Tops will be able to... Might be able to do something for you. I don't know. They're not as as, as generous as as, uh, as Panini on this sort of in this front, but we get a free top loader, Raiders. That's going to go to Sean Maddock. Oh, oh, that's the book. Sorry, signature three piece memorabilia. That's Sidney Rice. Triple relic and autograph. I guess it was old Vikings colors, but this is a Seahawk edition of Sidney Rice. Bennett, yes, there has been because you're because every team has hit. Because I've been keeping track of the hit list names, but I don't. Unfortunately, I don't remember what Kansas City hits there were. We got a 50 out of 89, Brock Osweiler, the Brock Lobster. Do, 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 do. Denver, Trevor. And there's Andre Johnson to 139. All right, that was 2012 five star. Now let's get into 2014 Tops five star football. These boxes were pretty cool because they have these cool little hinges right here. There's a little sponge on the bottom right there. All right, let's flip this over. Uh, rookie on card auto for the Bengals. This is one of my favorite five-star designs, that 2014 design there. Ooh, actually, could this fit into a 130 top look? Yeah, it actually fits pretty snugly there. Jeremy Hill, bangles, that's going to go to Chad. Next is Cody Latimer. That's a catch. Rookie auto for Denver for Trevor. Actually, this might go into a bigger top loader. Right? Trevor with Denver. Trevor, you'll also get this Julius Thomas autograph. Now for Brian and the Titans, Bishop Sankey. Ooh, nice one coming up. Old school guy. It's Eric Dickerson. 13 out of 25, Eric Dickerson. Great auto. That runs a little off the card there, but, but you can't contain Eric Dickerson. Rams, Brian Frank with the spot that he won, got randomized. The Rams gets that nice Eric Dickerson. All right, and the gold ink auto, golden graphs, that's a, one of the case hits, is uh, Sammy Watkins. Big, bold autograph from him too. 20 out of 20, rookie auto. That's Bill's edition. Derek Maxwell, last spot mojo. Buffalo! All right. That was five-star football. We got first off the line, impeccable football, 2019 edition. Give myself a little more room here. Oh, maybe 
Got a chance at a... Do they do metal cards in first off one? I'm not sure. Got some extra blank cards for me. We're all starting to run out. All right, Luke Keekley on top. Reveals his old teammate, Cam Newton to 75. Carolina for Zach. We got Tariq Cohen. 15 out of 25 for the Bears. Allen with the Bears. The Bears. Allen Murdoch. Jordan Scarlett, 18 out of 75. Rookie auto for Carolina, Zach. We got Vinny Testaverde, Indelible Ink, 25 out of 25. That is Ravens edition. Trevor with Baltimore. Be more. There's Jim McMahon for the Bears, 22 out of 49. Alan Murdoch with Chicago. Eight out of eight, John Elway. That will be for Denver, for Trevor and the Broncos, my rivals. And then we've got a big, nice Daniel Jones. One out of 19, rookie, dual relic, and on-card autograph. This could be a big season for Daniel Jones. Good time to get his RPA. That is for the New York football giants, Sean Maddock. The G Men. Big blue. A piece of the helmet looks like. Sharp. Sharp. Could have a big year this year. That card could go to the moon. Close to it. 2016 NT. Hobby edition. Just regular hobby edition. Pop there. Um, uh, a book on the bottom. What a great way to start off the football season, folks. An excellent Thursday night game and this 48 box mixer from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks, everyone, for uh, for making this happen. I appreciate it. 50 out of 99, Christian Hackenberg. Jets. Christopher Gerard. It's Mariota on top, by the way. 67 out of 99, Ed Reed. Ravens. Trevor. Triple Relic. 16 out of 25, Amir Abdullah. Coral Patterson. That's a nice patch. And Tyler Lockett. It's a randomizer. We'll take care of that randomizer along with the, all the other ones at the end. Uh, 99 out of 99, Matt Ryan, Colossal Pro Bowl Relic. Atlanta, Christopher A with the ATL. 7 out of 99, Cody Core, Bengals, Chad, Chad Dock. All decade, 1980, Kellen Winslow Sr., 25 out of, nine, out of 49, that is, not, not junior. Not, junior. Not, not, not a good kid. Uh, San Diego Chargers will I'll clearly go to the Los Angeles Chargers. Christopher Gerard, Los Angeles Chargers. Jacoby Brissett, 52 out of 99. Jersey and autograph, black ink auto for the Patriots. That's going to go to Jeff. And 
behind Mariota is 85 and a Devontae Booker book. Book it. We yeah, like Broncos. At least quantity wise having a having a nice break. That's for Trevor. That's with a that's with a spot that he won. That's not too bad. 21 25 Titans edition of Mariota, Brian Frank. All right, now 2020 National Treasures first off the line edition. Could be a there could be a monster here. Rex says, if I, if I find a redemption on the bottom, if I find a, a uh, Brandon Cooks 99 in Honors Football, you'll buy the person who gets the Brandon Cooks 99 a $10 gift card. Hopefully a $10 gift card to jazbeescasebreaks.com. All right, behind Calvin Ridley to 11 is Tom Brady to 99. Patriots edition. That's going to go to Jeff. We got Damian Harris, more Patriots, Sunday Treasures Dual Relic. 13 out of 99. We've got a triple relic, James Connor, Juju Smith Schuster, Chase Claypool. It's a solid trio there going to Pittsburgh, Trevor. Hmm, maybe. Maybe family. I don't want to get. I don't want to get a certain someone's hopes up, but we have seen it before. There's Christian McCaffrey dual relic to 99. Carolina. That's going to be for Zach. The book is Dan Fouts. One out of ten. Treasures of the Hall. Triple relic. Yeah, Chargers with a few old school guys popping out of here. <laughs> right, I, I'm not. I'm, I'm trying. I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. Dan Fouts going to the Bolts. Christopher with the Chargers. Out of 35, Andre Johnson. Two out of 35. Jersey and autograph for Houston. That's going to go to the Atlanta-Houston combo. Christopher A. We've got a Josh Kelly. Two out of two. Looks like a piece of his uh, cap and autograph. Christopher. With the Los Angeles Chargers. All aboard! Woo -woo. Yeah, it could, I mean, there are a lot of num there are a number of guys that have redemptions here. 30 out of 35, Jersey and autograph, Tory Holt. Nice Tory Holt for Brian Frank at the Rams. And the redemption behind Calvin Ridley, six out of eleven. Rookie patch autograph, stars and stripes, card 156. J O E B U R R O W, Joe Burrow. There it is, Chad, and in the stars and stripes parallel. It'll kind of look like this. Ooh. There it is. Chad's happy. OMG, he says. It's true. Your eyes are not deceiving you this late at night. That Stars and Stripes is pretty strong. Wait, are they really going for that much? 
No, they're not going for that much, are they? Family sports? Well, I guess it is NT. What, what am I thinking? Yeah, I mean, la I mean, last one in September eighth. So wow. Yeah, still created. That's graded though. But still, congrats, Chad. Nice hit. I'm looking at uh, I'm looking at 130 point. I'm, maybe I'm not typing in the right thing, but but that's where I'm looking at. But still, pretty awesome. All right, we can find some more awesome stuff in 2020 honors. Chase Claypool, Justin Herbert. And we've got Michael Vick. Rookie preview autograph for Atlanta. Christopher A. That's four out of 25. Christian McCaffrey, two out of two rookie auto for Carolina. Zach. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. I'm forgiven, Chad Dot. You're the one that made the trade. Well, I guess you're glad now. Now you're glad you made the trade. You should be forgiving yourself. <laughs> Patriots can still get a break. What happened here? All right. Willie Gay Jr. and Baker Mayfield. Once to 25, the other one's to 10. And then right on top, we got a rookie auto, Jalen Hurts. 20 out of 49. That'll be for uh, Philadelphia, John Sodaro. And an out of five, Chris Godwin. Rookie roundup. All aboard the Big Hit Express for the uh, Buccaneers. Derek. Woo -woo. You get a cut, Jimmy? I think you should. An agency fee? At A.J. Dillon and Michael Pittman Jr. And you got Michael Pittman Jr. Colts. That's three out of three, Michael Pittman Jr. Trevor, all the board. Woo -woo. Ooh, and look at this. Bennett was wondering if there were any good Chiefs. I didn't. I told him I didn't remember, but this is pretty memorable. Rated rookie, on-card autograph, black ink, one of one, Patrick Mahomes. Out of honors. Ooh. There you go, Bennett. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. I'm glad I... Uh, Save the honors to last, right? 
Uh, for Bennett and Chad and anyone else who wants, uh, you know, there's been some nice hits here. Got a Tua earlier. If you want uh, insurance, go to uh, jazbeescasebreaks.com. If you're on a mobile device, it's a small little circle with a question mark on it. And if you're on a, on, if you're on the, uh, on the desktop site, there's a bottom left-hand corner support. All right, so now this is 2019 honors football. 2019? 2018 honors football, but first off the line. Was, if, was this 2018 the infamous Brandon Cooks 99 box? There's Patrick Mahomes, second year Pat Mahomes to 99. What will that Mahomes go for? I'm not sure. A lot? Three out of nine. Eli Manning. Here's Nick Chubb. Rookie auto. Six out of nine. Save this for like picture time or something like that. Set this aside over here. There's Ron Jaworski, Jaws, indelible ink autograph, one of one. That's uh, John Sadaro with the Philadelphia Eagles. John, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Oh, and the, uh, the Chubb, by the way, that autograph goes to Colin and the Browns. And that's number, once again, it's numbered six out of nine. Nice. Oliver's thinking that Mahomes, it's got to be 50 to start. Would you have to send it, take it out of the one sent to PSA? No, I wouldn't. I would leave it here because I think you have the the integrity of the card is supposed to be like this, right? With the honor sticker on there. Yeah, I think out of honors, it wouldn't might not be that high, Oliver. Yeah, that's what family and Derek are saying. Just be, simply because it's not the, the the true rated rookie and autograph and all that stuff, but it's a big hit. All right, we got Josh Rosen Cardinals, five out of nine. It'll be for Sean in Arizona. And the last, well, yeah, this is the last card. It's going to be a one of one Chris Carter flawless autograph. Vikings edition. All he does is catch touchdowns. Alan Matsui. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Helmet time. First helmet. Yeah, you should absolutely get uh, insurance on the redemption. Even if it's a redemption, it still has value. But overnighting is also, I think, almost as important as well. Okay, who am I? Retired Hall of Fame running back. Ended up with 14,101 rushing yards. Um, 90 rushing touchdowns. 484 receptions for 3,329 receiving yards. 
and uh, receiving touchdowns, 10 receiving touchdowns. Played for two teams my entire career. This is the second team. The helmet is the second team that I was on. I was an NFL Offense Rookie of the Year, um, five-time Pro Bowler, a rushing yards leader, and a Pro Football Hall of Famer. Who am I? A former third-round pick. Nice one, Oliver. Curtis Martin. Oh, that's a nice Jets helmet. Wow. First of all, you've got the you've got some of these. You got the right L fitting instructions right here. There's the beautiful Curtis Martin autograph right there. Big bold auto. Maybe I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the, the camera above my head. You can see that a little bit better right there. But look at the color on that. I feel like we have pretty good production value here, but it's not really doing justice to the to the deep emerald green of this helmet. You got the Jets badge up front. Got New York on the back. Oh, you can kind of see the green a little bit better there. Woo! That's nice. That's Christopher Gerard with the New York Jets. Another round of Who Am I? Um, former uh, late first round pick. Played for three teams my entire career. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm still active, yeah. 31-year-old running back. 5'9", 215. Three-time Pro Bowler. A Heisman Trophy Award winner. Ah, oh. seven. He's pretty good. Seven thousand. Mark Ingram is right. Seven thousand three hundred twenty-four rushing yards, sixty-two rushing touchdowns, two hundred sixty receptions, ten touchdowns, almost nineteen hundred receiving yards. New Saints, Ravens, and currently on the Texans. I forgot he's thirty-one years old. Right? Yeah, he's already thirty-one, and it's Texans edition of Mark Ingram. This gold rush, they're pretty pretty current. Damn. That was fast. That was real fast. There's the big Texans logo right there. There's his, there's his autograph. I know Ravens fans are like, what? There's the Texans badge right up there. It's a pretty good looking helmet. NFL shield. All the authentication stickers are there. If I can make uh... Uh, we don't do the we don't do the scratch and redeem thing here, Family Sports. Unfortunately, we've, we've been we've been burned a couple times there. We don't do that anymore. So unfortunately, that will not be an option. Um, Houston is a uh, is a combo team. Atlanta and Houston comboed up. Christopher A. with that.
Good looking, good looking helmet, the helmet there. Next helmet. Where's my net? Yeah, Chad, you're on the you're on the west coast. Who am I? Active quarterback, 24 years old from Dana Point, California, went to San Clemente High School and went to USC, first round pick, played for two teams my entire career, a total of 8,097 yards, 45 touchdowns to 39 interceptions, five rushing touchdowns, was a first team all Pac-12, an Archie Griffin award winner and a Pac-12 Offensive Freshman of the Year. I think Rodgers has a little more than 8,000 yards in his career by now, and more than 45 touchdowns. Rodgers is also not from Dana Point. I think he's from Northern California, right? Marin? County? Not Leinert. I think you're on the right track. I think Liner also went to high school in Southern California, but not at San Clemente High. I don't think he went to San Clemente. But he did go to U.S. Uh, they both went to USC. There, Oliver, there you go. Another one for you. Sam Darnold, Oliver. Sorry, I missed that. And guess what? Look, look how quick... Look how quick Gold Rush is. It's Sam Darnold Panthers edition. There's his autograph right on the Panthers helmet. All right, so Sam Darnold, Carolina Pan, Zach Teal. All right, with Carolina. No, Mark, I, I don't think I don't think you're in this one. This is the this is the forty eight boxer. All right, and the final helmet. Last chance to play America's favorite game. Who am I? I give you the clues. You try to give me some answers for bragging rights. All right, who am I? All right, I am an active running back in the NFL. I have zero career NFL stats. Who am I? 
215 uh, out of Jennings, Louisiana. Went to Jennings High School. Then went to Clemson. Played for one team my entire career. A national champion. Two-time a- uh, ACC Player of the Year. Yeah, I have zero stats. Yeah, and, and he has a torn ACL. Yeah, everyone's getting it. Yeah, it's Travis uh, Travis Etienne, who's unfortunately on injured reserve. I was really looking forward to to his career, a Liss Frank injury, which I think is is across the top of your 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 foot. Yeah, it's it's pretty painful from what I read, right? So injured reserve, uh, unfortunately, but hopefully. He'll make it back stronger than ever. So we're really we're banking on future value for this guy here. There's his autograph right on top of the the helmet, white ink autograph. I mean, if you watch his college, I mean, look at the college national championship game, the throughout his career, college career, pretty amazing. Looking helmet. There's the other side, the non-auto side. It's got all the. It's got like the old Beckett sticker, and kind of harder to see right here, but where my thumb is pointing, the Beckett seal right here. Yeah, these are really good quality helmets. So that's pretty nice. All right, and the Jaguars. That will be for. Uh, that's another combo team, the Jacksonville Washington football uh, combo, Sean Maddock. Or Travis Etienne. All right, that was the last thing, ladies and gentlemen. Now we just got some housekeeping here to do. Um, the recap will be in a different video, but we're going to do some randomizing right now. All right. Hey, thank you, everybody. We made it. Appreciate it. Yeah, it's about a three hour, two hours and 53 minutes is where we're at. So here's what we're going to do. Let's do, let's do these randomizers right here. We'll do... Um, I don't know how we're gonna how we're gonna do this. Here's what I'm gonna do. So for this group right here, we're gonna lump that randomizer in with the hit packs. Remember, we're still giving away those hit packs, which I will open for you. Let's bring that window back down to regular size. So when I randomize everyone's names, the top 10 will get the Jaspies hit packs. Number 11 will get that RPA of the undrafted player, and 12 will get the, all the points as one lot. And then we'll do these, obviously, in a couple different dice rolls right here. Let me close out some windows here. Let me open up some more random.org windows. I need one, two, three. Okay, so we're going to use one dice roll for the three lists. The first one, the first list is going to be uh, the Cincinnati Houston one, the, the dual relic with Deshaun Watson and Joe Mixon. The second one will be the triple relic with Amir Abdullah, Minnesota Vikings version of Cordell Patterson, and Seattle version of Tyler Lockett. And this will be everyone. Everyone's got a shot at it. At the hit packs. What else do I need to do here? So we did that giveaway. So yeah, the hit pack giveaway, and everyone got something, at least. So so that won't be going out, but the top ten will be uh, 
We'll be right there. And I'll, I'll, I'll rip those open for you, too. All right. Oh, and I should probably, yeah, I'll randomize you pack numbers, too. So maybe I, I need a fourth dice or a fourth list. And a fifth list for the names. And, uh, but we'll use, we'll use the same dice roll for everything, just to make it easy on me. Let's roll it and randomize it. Six and a three, nine times. Name on top after, name or teams on top after nine. One. Good luck. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. And ninth and final time. Cincinnati gets that one. That'll be for Chad. We're on Cincinnati. You'll get that Respectra dual relic card, sorry. That's what it looked like. Number to 75. The triple relic. Once again, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And ninth and final time. After nine, we got Seattle. That's going to go to uh, Gale with the Seahawks, the Hawks of the Sea. So you'll get that out of 25 triple relic from NT. All right, once again, nine times this time for, uh, for the hit packs. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time after nine. Well, congrats to Colin. You got a pack. Chad, you'll get the, um, oh yeah, Chad, you'll get the, this guy. Tamorian Terry, who apparently was undrafted and was not on the, the official checklist that we were using to look up uh, the hits. So you'll get that. And then, uh, Michael Robinson, you'll get all those points. Winner take all on the points. There you go. And you got that nice Tua, too. All right, so those are for you. Now, top 10, hit packs. Colin, you got a pack. It's a nice giveaway right here. Brian, in addition to all your hits. Trevor. Chris. Uh, why were there only 30... Come on. <sighs> All right, well, here's what I'm going to do. The hit packs are going to remain the same. Sean, I just completely forgot you forgot your name up here. Um, we're going to figure out some kind of break credit to send to you for that. Sorry about that. Because I can't, I can't re-randomize that whole list. All right, sorry, Sean. We're, we'll 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 talk later about that. Um, hit packs: Colin, Brian, Trevor, Christopher, uh, Derek, Gail. Trevor, Brent, John, and Derek Watley. There you go. Top 10 right here. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to talk to Nick. We'll, we'll, we're, we'll probably send you like $100 of break credit or something like that. Um, just <laughs> because I forgot your name. I'd rather just pay you off in blood money <laughs> than, uh, than make these 10 people angry. So I, I apologize, Sean. That was just my, it's been a long week and a long break. Um, Anyhow, these 10 are in. So now let's put your names here. Let's 
take your names again here. And now I'm going to randomize names and pack numbers together. So names and pack numbers together. So I'll just put that on a I'll just put that on a different tab right here. So once again, nine times for those top ten names right there, and then we'll match up with the pack and we'll rip that pack. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. All right, we got John down to Gale. Six and a three, nine times for the pack numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Three down to two. All right, so John, you have pack three, Derek with four, Trevor with seven, Brent with eight, Derek with nine, Colin with five, Chris with one, Trevor with 10, Brian with six, and Gail with two. So we're going to sort by column B numerically right there. And now, uh, you know what? I'll print out labels for this. Just like we do with our uh, with our hit pack breaks, that might be a little bit easier. So let's do that. Stop, Rex. All right, so now we got that squared away. Let's get the packs. Got the team bags right here. All right, so this is the, the end of break giveaway. Christopher, thanks for getting into the action. You get hit pack number one. And that's gonna be a Mahomes. There you go, eight out of 10. Patrick Mahomes from uh, Panini Black, quad relic and autograph. Out of 2020, Panini Black football. Nice, it's already in a bag. Boom, that goes to you. All right, next up is Gale, pack two. Good luck, Gale. It is, ooh, Daniel Jones. Nice, Rook, Contenders Rookie Auto, Daniel Jones. PSA 10, that's pretty strong. Nice rookie ticket autograph. Congrats, thanks for getting to the break. And to all those mixers and fillers. John Sodaro, pack three for you. It's 
going to be... Ooh, 9-10 rookie ticket autograph, Baker Mayfield. Could have a big season this year. I don't know if I called your, your number out too often in the break, John, so there you go. Thanks for getting in. Glad you got a 9-10 Baker Mayfield. Corners are a 9-5. Edges and corners, or centering's a 9-5. Edges and corners are a 9. Surface is a 9. Or, a, yeah, a 9. Sorry, a little more half grades there, but but still a nice Baker Mayfield. There you go. Thank you, John. Next is Derek Maxwell. Got last spot mojo. Last spot mojo. Not too sure if I called your number out too often in this break for the Bills, but you're going to get a Joey B. Green Scope, Joe Burrow from 2020 Prism Football, PSA 9. All right, nice little parting gift. And that's 24 out of 75. Hopefully it has a big season. Watch the value of this card go up. All right, next up. Colin McCarver. Let's see what we got for you, Colin. Oh, it's a uh, 2020 uh, Mosaic NFL No Huddle Box. Congrats. And I have that. My cabinet right over there. There it is. This is going to be the one. That post-it note right over here, just in case it doesn't peel off the uh, the packaging too easily. But there you go, Colin. That's yours. It'll ship to you sealed, probably probably separately from all the other um, from all of your other cards. So just anticipate that arriving in a different box or a different shipment or something like that. And it'll send to you sealed. So, Brian. Pack six. Ooh, Kyler Murray. Let's hope he has a big year too. 2019 Panini Donners Optic Orange. PSA 10, Kyler Murray. One fifty out of one ninety nine. All right, Trevor, pack seven. That's that's pretty nice. So he was in a won a spot in a filler into that mixer. Got a three thousand dollar football mixer spot, right? And then turned that also into one of the giveaways. It's pretty good, Trevor. You saved a, save yourself a bunch of money. Let's now let's see what you got in here. It's a PSA 9, one of one, Dak Prescott. You almost beat Tom Brady in Tampa Bay today. 2020 Panini Donner's Optic, Dak Prescott, gold vinyl, one of one, PSA 9. Trevor, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. This could be a big season for Dak Prescott. I, what team did he get with all that? With Moz Pack 17, Luck 1, Ravens. I don't think there are too many, too many Ravens in that break. All right. Brent. Got a spot straight up. Let's see what we've got for you, Brent. Ooh, another box redemption. Ooh, Hit Parade Football VIP edition. That's pretty nice. And we'll also ship this to you sealed. 
So you can sell it if you want to. You can rip it open if you want to. It's, it's yours. Thanks, Brent. Appreciate it. All right, Derek. Not sure if I called your number too often in this break, but here is pack nine for you. We got, ooh, another Kyler Murray from 2019 Select. Kyler Murray Red Prism PSA 10. Rookie Red, nice color match with his team. You're welcome, Brent. Thank you. 50 out of 99. There you go, Derek. And last but not least, remember the recap video will be in a separate video, just because this break's already almost three hours and 15 minutes. There's pack 10. Oh, Trevor again. What a, buy a lottery ticket, Trevor. Look at that. What a lucky SOV. Trev. Well, your last, the last hit out of the football hit pack is a nice Genesis Justin Jefferson PSA 10. Wow, this was the other one. This was Colts. What a, what a lucky son of a gun. Nice Genesis super short print Justin Jefferson out of Mosaic. PSA 10. And if he if he has a season like he did last year, woo, that's going to be pretty nice. All right, boys and girls, is that it? I think that's it. I think everything's been taken care of. Guys and girls, thank you so much. I appreciate it. This, this was such a, a huge break to fill, but we got all the fillers done. We got, we got the break itself done tonight, right on Thursday night, week one, the first game of the football season. The game was great. This break was great. And hopefully that's a sign of things to come for the football season for not only for us, but for you as a collector and just for the NFL in general. Stick with us all season long. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.